Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm actually filming this intro after the vlog will have started, if that makes sense. So it's Wednesday today, I worked on Monday and Tuesday and I thought I would vlog the rest of the week because I'm not working again this week and I've got a few things planned. I'm definitely filming this in the wrong order. I've just been to have my nails done and I just got plain pink and kept them quite short. But my middle nails have actually broke, like they snapped off, so they're shorter than the rest of them. So I've been to my nail appointment and I also went into Primark and spent... Oh no! Oh no. Oh no. I've just spilled water all over me. Luckily it's only water so it'll dry, but that's just gone everywhere. Anyway, as I was saying, um, I also nipped into Primark. And hope no, one, hope no one saw that. I nipped into Primark because we're going on holiday next week, so I needed some holiday clothes that actually fit me. I bought a lot of like summery clothes when we went to Venice, but it was like denim shorts, and they're definitely not going to do up anymore. So I just stopped at Mackey's on my way home because I'm starving. I got a large fries and a mayo chicken, so I'm going to eat that now. McDonald's are doing Monopoly again and I thought I wouldn't get any because I didn't get a meal but it's on my fries so I'm just going to see if I've won anything. Oh no, I can't even get it off because my nails. No. We've actually got a scan booked for in two hours and it's a 4D baby scan so we'll get to see baby boy's face. The only thing I'm thinking is because I have an anterior placenta it might be harder to get him to show his face so but we'll see hopefully it will all be good i'm really excited and i can feel him kicking right now so hopefully he carries on moving during the scan so i'm going to drive home now pick zimmy up and then we'll be going to the scan also we're taking both our mums with us so that'll be nice for them to come with us and also see the baby so number one job for today is to sort all of this out and to give my room a proper clean and tidy. Like even this mirror is filthy. And I've got my first hot chocolate of the year. This is the, is it Belgian? Belgian salted caramel one, it's so nice. It's literally my favorite hot chocolate. So it's actually Sunday now. My original plan was to vlog this week, but it's just not gone as expected. But yeah, I've decided to pick up the camera again and me and Zimmy are going to Oktoberfest at Alton Towers, so I think I'm going to vlog a little bit. This is just what I'm wearing. I don't even know if these shoes go, to be honest. Do they go? Probably not. But I've literally got no bottoms that fit me, so I've had to put these brown leggings on. But yeah, um, all my other leggings are in the wash. So we're going to go to Alton Towers now. Does anyone else just leave their parcels on the floor for like days and days until they can be bothered to sort it out? Because I've got my sheen parcel there, I've still got my Primark bag there, I've got a misguided parcel there. That way. I'm on a little walk through the woods because there's nothing to do when you're pregnant <laughs> which was expected but we'll probably get lost fishies she's wearing white shoes <laughs> round trousers beige jumper diet coat and short hair <laughs> Hey, is that Zimmy Mukai? Zimmy, can you... Falling for the words, man. <laughs> Where does that accent come from? Might be getting lost. Wow. Romeo, thy Romeo. <laughs> Let down thy hair. That's what happened, <laughs> Oh, that's Rapunzel. <laughs> 
Rapunzel. Hey, Rapunzel. We got down by her. Watch what you do. <laughs> yeah. It's green. Uh, but that was someone's house. That didn't zoom in. It's so sunny. Well, did you used to do this when you're in like year ten, year nine, year eight? I feel like it's winter and summer at the same time. Like this just looks like autumn. With the orange leaves and the sun, but it's a little bit cold. Tell us a story about this bridge. Wow. And then what? Cling on to the bush? Let's have a look at it. Lovely. What's it called? No. Oh, it's weird. No other funny thing. Other people's birthdays. Oh, yeah. Someone's 29. <laughs> that nice. And someone who's seven. We've just come into the fried chicken because I really wanted some goujons. semi has got a burger that's nearly gone. Oh no, it hasn't. Yeah, it has. We've just got some goujons. Gonna get a hole in one. Right, big one thousand. Did it go in? <laughs> and got another ten balls. I feel like it's going to start chucking it down in a minute. That was great. That's how you want it. Man. Right, this is the one. That wasn't the one. Get the ball. Right, last ball. <laughs> Found two P, so I'm going to put it in here. Oh, 
have to cut the thing? Oh, no, we just said a bit. How about we go? Okay, one more. I don't understand how you put it. Oh, there's a. I don't get it. Got some biscoff churros. Yummy. Yeah. I've got biscoff on my camera. There's lots of sugar everywhere. Come on. <laughs> Oktoberfest and I've made myself a little hot chocolate and I thought I'd show you what I got from Primark and Shein. Is it Shein? Sheen? Shine? I don't know. I thought it was called Shein Side so I always say Shein but I think that's wrong. I don't know. So I bought these clothes because I'm going on holiday next week and we're actually going to Spain so I was thinking it'd be really sunny but it's actually giving out rain for the whole time we're there. I brought these little crocodile clip things I've already taken it out of the pack because I was trying it and I don't know if I'm actually going to use them but we'll see. The next thing I got was this orange shirt. That was very bright. I've actually gone a bit all out with the colour. Like I'm used to wearing like grey, white, black, beige but I've actually gone all out with the colour. And I thought I'd just go for more colour for this holiday. So yeah I got this shirt that was... 13 pounds so not too bad and then i thought as an outfit i could wear it with this top this was four pound it's just like a little crop top it feels really nice material as well actually it's really like stretchy and like soft and then to wear with these like cycling shorts which are the same material they're really stretchy so i feel like they'll fit nicely either like on my bump or under my bump or whatever but they were £4 as well. I also got this pink dress. It's going to be quite hard to show. So it's got like the thin straps. It's got like a cowl neck. And then it's like ruched. Like at the waist. And it just ties at the side. So like one leg is out. It's really hard to show this. And it's quite long. But this looks really nice with a bump. And it fits really well. And it's like stretchy so... Thought that'd be nice for like to wear in the evening if we go out anywhere. I also got this blue dress, which is quite similar. These bits tie around the neck, like they cross over at the front and tie around the neck, and then it's like ruched at the sides, um, and the back's quite open as well. I just thought this colour was really nice and it goes really well with my hair that'll be nice to wear just i'm not sure what bra i'm gonna wear with this 
but we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. So yeah. <laughs> and that was only £11. And then I just got like a few bits and bobs from Primark. So I just got some elastics for my hair. Some tape, like boob tape. Um, this like stick on bra thing which I won't bother showing and some underwear like granny pants so yeah that's what I got from Primark and then I'll show you what I got from Shein I've gone like I've gone for quite a lot of dresses like from Primark and Shein because I just find it the easiest to wear when you've got a bump because it's hard finding like trousers that fit right and look nice so yeah dresses are just easy because then you don't have to worry about pairing tops to bottoms and it's just one whole outfit and it's just easier so i got this dress which looks like this it's got thin straps again and it's quite long it goes it goes like down to my knees but the only thing with this is i feel like it's more of like an autumn winter kind of dress like i'd wear this with like maybe tights and boots and stuff but yeah don't know whether I'm going to take this on holiday because I just have a lot of dresses that I think would look better. It's so soft, it feels like woolly. So yeah, I think that'll be nice in the winter. And then I've got this cord, which I really like actually. Basically, it ties around your neck at the top and then you put your arms through there and then it just ties up at the back. So it's got quite an open back and the front is like this. Why are these clothes so hard to show? And then it just goes with a skirt, which is really stretchy at the waist, ideal for the bump. And it's just ruched as well. And again, it just shows like one leg out. So I think it's really flattering. And I'll probably wear this under the bump. I like the color as well, it's quite different. Next, I've got this like mint green dress. This is like a shorter one, but it's really nice fits really nice this is perfect for the bump as well because it's just so stretchy could wear that during the day the next thing i've got is another dress so this has one shoulder it's ruched on both sides so they just like tie at the side if you can see that they had it in so many different colors but i thought this was like the most summery and holiday and then i also got another cord so this is the top it's just like a little crop top i love this color brown like I'll probably wear this in the winter and autumn. The skirt to go with it, I love this skirt. So it has like this little detailing at the top. And again, this is quite a long skirt, but it's so flattering. Like I'll be able to wear this under the bump, on the bump, like it's so stretchy. But yeah, I love that. And then the last two things I got were two bags. So I've got this pink one. This is a really weird material though, like I like how it's, I like how it's like, what would you call it, snake skin or crocodile? I don't actually know the difference, I don't know what this is, but it's got like a really nice pattern on it, but it's a bit of a weird material, like it's like fabric. And then I got this white one as well, which is like the same sort of print, but this is like a shiny material. Or is the other ones like fabric? So yeah, that's everything I got from Primark and Shein for my holiday. I'll be having at least one of these a day. Until it's like summer next year. So we went for a 4D baby scan on Wednesday. It's a different one. He was actually covering his face. For most of the scan, it is a little foot. And this was his arm covering his face during the scan. So it took quite a while to get a good photo. But we got there in the end and actually I'm really happy with how they turned out. Literally I'm obsessed. I didn't think they'd come out as good as this, so that's good. Sorry this vlog's been all over the place. I don't actually know what I've filmed again. If you did enjoy, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video.